my, my hearth down. I'm using my toes as a guide to hold that hearth down. It's, I've always had the best luck doing this barefoot uh, because boots are a bit clunky, I feel like. So if you can, take your shoe off and really get, get your feet on there and feel the, feel the hearth board. My spindle's in place. Here we go. So when you first start off, keep it nice and steady because you just want to see if you're gathering any dust. Can you see the dust falling in there? Yeah. So now I can pick up my speed a bit. Yeah, it does. I mean, you can keep using that hole for a long time. No, it's good. I've never seen that much of the dust come out of a boat. That's amazing. So now you want to be real calm. Let this, let this do its own thing. You see how it's still smoking a bit? How did she go? Give it a little bit of air. Here, honey. Come on, Santa, you don't have to rush this part. Okay? It's really important because... Getting that coal can be really hard sometimes. So now I've got my coal, still smoking, dropping into my tinder bundle. It's best to have the wind to your back, to hold it above your head, above your eyes, and your mouth, because you're going to breathe in as you're breathing out. And breathing in that smoke can really put you down if you're tired. That down. And remember to always give thanks to the fire, because the fire is what made us human. And it's our responsibility as humans to keep this fire alive and be healthy with it, have a good relationship with fire. Otherwise, we have forest fires that, that get put out and they don't get to live their life out, and we have forests that suffer.